So here we go, we are back into the game and the event is finally here in FIFA Mobile 22. About like 2 or 3 hours late, but it's finally here. As you can see, we've got group stage, challengers, event. Make sure to like and subscribe if you are excited for it. I'm gonna go ahead and get through the event and see what's going on. First of all, let's go ahead and get into the event then. Uh, we've got this main chapter, then UCL, UEL and UECL as well. Uh, Alright, Mbappe is making me click this first right let's go into the main chapter we've got this uh, cl a gift i guess to claim 50 gsc points as well as a hundred gsc tokens we can open packs with those gsc tokens i believe we've got this ads as well where we can get base item we can get one of these and we've got a chance to pack 95 overall ucl player that's actually not bad we've got we've got a chance to pack 95 plus overall ucl player uh, how big is that chance though? I don't think we got like huge amount of chance, but it, it's something I guess it's something from from that every single day We've got a chance to get that. We've got these milestones uh, We've got skill games two skill games as well as one one match against AI here to get extra GSC points and at the end to get extra GSC points as well as GSC tokens and get charts here We're gonna get 50 UCL, UEL and USCL charts uh, this week win skill games and matches in gsc to unlock 50 of each type of shards we, we need to just do it nine times and it's gonna be very very easy to do um and then let's go ahead and get into the ucl chapter then we've got 99 overall holy there enhanced icon holy five star record five star skill moves that card is gonna be disgustingly good 99 overall but the stats are incredible six foot three high high work rate solid player speed dribbler playmaker and power headed traits Long passing skill was, I like that card a lot. You need to claim the weekly milestone from either UCL, UEL or UECL chapter. Okay. Um, and play matches in UCL group stage to get 200 GSC token. Okay. And we, we can select one of these two this week. Um, we go, I'm going to select the first one. We are going to get 500 GSC points. All right, let's go ahead and get that. And we are going to be able to play these matches, of course and we've got okay we've got a chance to pack some of these shards oh yeah obviously we do obviously we do we've seen it in the event guide but yeah we can go ahead and play all these matches we've got a week to play this and when we play all the matches we're gonna get 200 extra gsc tokens okay then let's go into the uel chapter now let's see what's going on here we can choose a team uh we can choose a group here as well i'm gonna choose the arsenal one that's the best thing we've got 500 extra gsc points here we go, and we got the same thing here pretty much. Uh, we've got 99 overall Hullet gain, and we've got UECL groups as well. Which one should I go with the West Ham, I guess? I'm gonna go with the West, with the West Ham one. 500 GSC points again, and we've got these teams right there, where we are gonna get extra GSC points as well as shards. Let's now go into GSC rewards then. Uh, here is where we can, we can get the high overall players we're gonna be able to spend our gsc points here uh, by the way i would suggest you not to spend your gsc points straight away because we've got future groups that you can see there and just save them all up and at the end you can decide which group you want to go for we got 97 overall basi here or basi calvin basi basi 97 overall yaremchuk we've got 94 overall samset from uh, from the Europa League, we got Teal 94 overall and 90 plus overall player here. Uh, we, we need to spend GSC points for this and at the end we can buy this with uh, with the shards. Here we go, even better players of course. 103 overall, now Carrasco, 5 star recruit, 4 star skill most. That card is going to be very very nice indeed. Agility skill boost, 6 foot 1, high high work rates, yeah, that card is going to be good. 103 overall, Arthur 4 star, 4 star, decent center mid as well, pretty decent center mid, 5 foot 7, long passing skill boost, I would still suggest you to save them, save those points and don't spend them straight away, definitely, and you've got this, I would definitely suggest you not to do this, don't buy these packs because it's not going to be worth it at all, and yeah, that's pretty much it with this, right, you've got Mandanda there as well, the goalkeeper, he's 6 foot 1, we go 101 overall. Saka, that Saka card is not bad either, but three star skill moves for him. It's not it's not good enough. Yeah, not bad, not bad. Right. As I said though, I would I would save all the points 
and I will spend them at the end. Now let's go into GSC offers. Let's see what we go into the GSC offers. We've got UCL player box, we've got UEL offer and UECL offer. We can go ahead and purchase this pack with a thousand uh, tokens, GSC tokens. We obviously go, how many now? A hundred, yep, a hundred. It's gonna take a while to get a thousand, but after 10 packs, you're gonna be able to get the guaranteed one. And these are gonna refresh weekly. We go one of four overall or campus there. He's tall, right? Yeah, he's six foot two for a right winger. That's quite tall. Four star, four star, 114 pace, 120 shooting. Good stats for him. Not bad, not bad at all. Um, nice. We've got 102 overall Diogo Jota. I'm excited for that card. I'm quite excited for that card. I can't lie. That's a good card. Shooting, skill boost, five foot 10. We've got 100 overall Felipe as well. Not the best card, probably. We've got 99 overall Demir Bay. Same thing. Five star, four star is good. He's a bit slow, though. Uh, we got McGregor from Rangers, and we got some other players as well. We got uh, GSC UCL Prime icon as well. We need to spend thirty six thousand tokens in twenty one days to get one hundred seven overall centre back Prime hero, which is not gonna happen by the way. Free to play, six foot two, a uh, couple of trades, medium high or crazy. Obviously a great card for here or there. Now let's get into the UEL offers then. Uh, we got. We can sp we, we need 400 GSC tokens to get this. All right, um, we've got this right here. We can get UEL player 92 plus. 103 overall Fabio Vieira is there. There is 100 overall Joao Pedro. There is 99 overall Zab Zabarni from Ukraine. All right, from each of these, we can get this or other, uh, other rewards like three elite players. 5 golds, 10 silvers, 250,000 coins, and so on and so on. And then we go UECL as well, where it's a little bit different again. Uh, we, we can buy this for 750 FIFA points. I, I mean, is it worth it? For 90 plus, it's, I don't think it is. We go, we're, share, we're sharing here. For nine, maximum, we're gonna get 97 overall. So I don't think it's worth it really to buy this. Bam! Uh, we need we can we can get some uh, one of these rewards for 250 GSC tokens for this and we are also gonna get some milestones as well from this all right let me know where you're gonna spend your tokens on just like I said with those GSC points I would suggest you to save up these points as well or I would suggest you to save up these tokens as well to and spend them at the end uh, at the end of the week if you uh, if you want to spend them this week bam also, you can carry them on, of course. That's pretty much it with the event. Let's go ahead and get into the Star Pass. Let's see what we go in the Star Pass. We've got 97 overall Onana in the first day. Um, for If we buy the Star Pass, of course, we've got 97 overall Amin Harit, 4 star, 5 star. Not bad. Not the best, though. We've got 95 overall Oscan as well uh, for free. Nice. Um, we've got 97 overall. Matvienko as a center back. Okay, 99 overall Bisuma. Ivan Ives Bisuma, sorry, no, Ivan Bisuma. Ives Bisuma is there from Tottenham. High medium work rates for a CDM. I don't like that that much. You got 98 overall Sadik for free uh, from uh, Real Sociedad and 102 overall for Fana. That Fana card that is, I think, going to be quite good. And at the end, we've got 105 overall. Haji for uh, if you buy the star pass and if you don't we'll go one one overall Milik which is not bad at all. We also got the secondary uh, secondary pass right here it is. We can get ninety nine overall Tsiganko as a start five star four star. Yeah, not bad for ninety nine. I mean, getting a ninety nine overall player from that straight away is not bad. And at the end we're gonna get ninety five overall Ma Mandgar Mandragora. For free which is not a great card and if you buy the star pass you're gonna get patrick chic 100 overall not awful but probably not one of the better cards either he's quite slow yep and in the store let's see what we got do we have anything interesting in the store star pass i'm obviously gonna buy the star pass not right now though in a bit i'm, I'm gonna buy the star pass um for the next video maybe we've got 105 overall neymar is in the store Oh, okay. That card is incredible, of course, but it's a little bit annoying that he's in the store, isn't it? It's a little bit annoying that he's in the store. 
I mean, I would open some of these packs, but I'm probably not going to get him, so I don't. I'm not really going to open any. I can I can spend 500 gems. Let's go ahead and do that. And go 100,000 coins. Definitely not worth it, but for 500... I mean, do I do that as well? We got only 1% chance. I'm going to do it. Nope, we didn't get him. <laughs> we did not get him. All right. Uh, let's get that 750 extra GSC points as well then. Nope, nothing from here either. And nope, I can't do any more. I can't do any more, unfortunately. But I tried. I tried to get it right. And quests. Do we have any new quests? We do. We've got these daily quests here to get extra challenger. To get challenger credit for the secondary star pass. And the weekly one as well to get for the secondary star pass. And we are going to get 200 GSC tokens at the end as well. Anyways, this is going to be the end of the video guys for today. Please make sure to like and subscribe if you enjoyed it. And peace.